Well, good afternoon, everybody. It is uh, terrific to have you along for our live coverage of this uh, eagerly awaited contest. It should provide some terrific entertainment on uh, what is turning into a rather imperfect afternoon. The weathermen rarely get it wrong, and uh, they have warned us that there is rain on its way. Shouldn't be bad enough in any sense meaningfully to impact on the game of football, but it is a factor to be taken into consideration. Plenty of other factors, of course, principally each side's concern for the strengths of the other. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. Quite some performance, and now here comes the response. Plenty looking forward to seeing this, a capacity crowd here. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. So off we go then. Team, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Um, Pepe may well need to be at his best. There's a power about his game, thanks to very decent pace for a big man. And he doesn't lose out much in the air either. He could... And the shots! And there's an early warning shot across the bow. Ruben Diaz. William Carvalho. Pepe tries to get it forward quickly. And it will be a throw in. Conte. And Titi. Pogba. Hopper drives it forward. Mbappe going through. Oh, managed to get it away. Giroud. He's tried one. Just swings wide. Oh, how close was that to going in? It only required the smallest of tweaks. Portugal have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Defence has got rid of that. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Pepe. Pepe goes looking. It's all a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust, hoists it forward, last ditch defending but that'll do.
Mondi. So it is still nil-nil. Forward it goes. Mbappe. Now it's Griezmann. He has it out wide now. Header! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. Portugal can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Bruno Fernandes. Nelson Semedo. Giroud gets it back. And it's Matuidi. Lovely bit of skill there. Gets the chuck. Heads it! <laughs> Goal! France! And France are in front! And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. So we have our breakthrough. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Giroud. And here's Griezmann. Hoists it high. Tries a shot! Disappearing out of sight. Well, when the game's played like that, it's made to look very simple. You know, I love watching football like this. Easy, effective, one, two, and bang. Thanks very much. Things starting to look very comfortable. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Nelson Semedo. Bruno Fernandes. Just brushed off the ball there. Mbappe. Pavard. France have scored two quick goals here and are well and truly in the driving seat. And the shot! Time to deliver. Well, when the options aren't quite present in the box, it's the crosser's interest to, uh, to hold on for the support. Guerrero. Guerrero plays it towards the front. Ruben Neves, and it's played forward. Conte. Coming up to half-time, leading, and things are looking pretty good. Mbappe. It's got through. It's Griezmann! Oh, denied brilliantly! Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. They've played it short. Semedo plays it forward. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. 
Pogba. Pavar. Mbappe. Now, can he capitalise? Out to the left it goes. Matuidi set up one goal so far. Pogba. Griezmann clips one through. Has a hit! A really close shave and the last action of the first half. Some first half thoughts. France just didn't want the half-time whistle to be blown. Convincing and controlled. France sitting pretty here at half-time. 2-0 up. is back on the way. Ruben Diaz. Pixie. Guerrero. Mbappe battles to win it back. Rafael Varane. Griezmann. Griezmann gets it out to the wing. Pavar. Mbappe. Looking to run onto it. Plenty waiting in the middle. Mbappe. Mbappe wants to play it back. Pavar tries to get some whip on it. Bit of a misjudgment. Ruben Neves, Pizzi, Nelson Semedo, Bernardo Silva, Bruno Fernandes, good challenge, he just stood firm, and it's Griezmann, oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger, Pepe, Ruben Diaz, France with his two-goal lead. Yeah, certainly looking much the more assured side. Pavar. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? Looking for space out wide. Mbappe. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Pogba. Pings it out wide. Conte. Mbappe, a scorer already in the game. Oh, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Pizzi. And it's Bernardo Silva. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And they've been caught out here. He's through, it's one-on-one, -on -one. it's one! And it's there! And surely that settles it. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really commit forward in numbers, too. It was all very well drilled. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. 
Pitsy. Hoists it forward. And he has been fouled there. Bernardo Silva. Bernardo Silva. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. One straight back. Dinks one in. And the defence can get it clear. Portugal are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Pepe goes on an adventurous run. Hogberg battles to win it back. Mondi. Giroud is effectively being marked out of the game here. Yeah, and the fact that he's registered, Peter, simply encourages more attention of, um, of a, a closer nature. Gets up! Portugal making another change here. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but he couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. And he's there to cut it out. Pizzi. Just starting to get the first signs of rain here. Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. Ruben Diaz. Well, that's where he wants it. And that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. And out to safety. That is Conte. Griezmann. Matuidi. Mendy gets into some space. Pizzi. Mario Rui. Finds himself. Uh, looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Pepe, Ruben Neves, Pepe, oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Now it's Matuidi. He gets past his man. Matuidi is on his own. The referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. 
France, yeah. irresistible here, dominant, utterly ruthless, only ever one result, a comfortable win. Your final thoughts, Jim? France will